hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss about how to add archive or unarchive option for our model in Odoo version 13 so currently if i go to contacts menu uh, that is default module of Odoo and if i take any of the contact and if i click on the action button you can see there is option for archive and once i get archive this record you have the option for unarchive in this record so let's see how we can add the same thing in our module so we are continuing our development in the school module so if i go to school and if i open record currently we don't have any rq button there so let's see how we can add that into our model so for that what you have to do is that i'll go to the pycharm and this is the corresponding model that is school.student so for getting the rq bar and rq option there is nothing much complicated or no more steps in earlier versions we have to define in i think in in till version 12 what we have to do is that we have to add a field in corresponding model and then we have to make changes in the view also so from order 13 onwards we don't have to make any changes inside the view just we have to define a field name active inside the corresponding model so i'll just copy this field and i will paste it here so what we have to do is that we have to define a boolean field with the name active inside the corresponding model and nothing has to be done inside the xml file just you need to paste a code that is you have to define a field with name active of type boolean and you can just restart the service so i'll just restart the service from here and there is nothing to do with the xml so in earlier versions we have to define a smart button in the xml side so it's not necessary or it's not required or it has not been needed from Odoo version 13 just you need to add a field like this so let's go to the ui and let's upgrade the module so currently if you check you can see there is no option for archiving and unarchiving so let's upgrade the module so i will go to the apps menu and from the apps menu i will upgrade the module so from apps menu i will open my module that is cool so i'll just make search of the module and i'll just upgrade the module so what we have done is we have taken gone to the corresponding model that is school.student and inside the model i have added a new field that is active equal to fields.boolean given a string that active and default should be always true so let's wait until the module get upgraded so you can see the module has already upgraded so if i go to the school and if i select sam and if i click on action button you can see archive bar and archive option has been get added so earlier when we have checked there was no right now this is an archived so i'll just unarchive it okay let me check sam okay that's archived so getting to filter an archive records active is false Okay, Sam is here. So I'll just click on here and unarchive him. So that's done. So this is how simply you can add archive bar and unarchive option into your model. Just define a field with name active of type boolean. So please subscribe to our channel and like our videos. Thank you.